how to use clockify with trello to track time hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can integrate clockify to trello.com in order to track time and manage products so let's get started first what you have to do is you will simply go to clockify.me if you have no idea about clockify clockify is a time tracking software free to use and allows you to track time very easily so make sure that you create an account on clockify first and you have clockify to create an account on clockify all you have to do is simply enter your email email address, choose a password, agree to terms, and click on create account. We can also continue with Google. Once you have created your Clockify, this is where you will get. Now, what you have to do is you will simply go to Trello. So Trello.com is a project management software and one of the very famous ones, very easy to use and has the feature to allow you to add different integrations. And that's what I will show you today. Simply sign into your Trello or create a new account on Trello with your Google account. So after the initial sign up, this is where you will get or once you sign in, this is where you will get on Trello. Now, first what you have to do is you will simply select a workspace in which you want to add Clockify to. So you can see I have a lot of different workspaces. I will select this workspace right here which is known as test and I will go to its boards. We have to select a board on which we want to add Clockify to. We want to integrate Clockify to that board and it will help us track time directly for the projects or the tasks we are creating on Trello. Now simply select a board. So I will select this one. It will open up my board on Trello, a basic board that I have. I actually want to add the option to track time. Don't get that option on Trello directly. So that's why we need to add it. So to add the integration of Clockify to Trello, what you have to do is once you are in your board, you will simply go to power ups. Power ups are integrations on Trello and it allows us to add different integrations to our boards. Click on add power ups. It will open up the power up option for you, the marketplace. In here, we can actually find all of different applications such as Slack. We have our Gmail, Microsoft Teams and others. So to save time, we can also actually search for different applications according to different niches given here, such as developer tools, HR and operations, analytics and reporting. So we will actually search for Clockify. There you go. Once you type Clockify and there you go, Clockify integration for Trello. You can see it has the same logo and this is the Clockify that you were looking for. Clockify integration for Trello is an easy way to operate with time tracker inside a Trello board. Now all you have to do is click on add. Again, it will actually add all of the different options for you so that you can see. We are giving access to Clockify to access the board, take actions and more. Simply click on add and it will be added to your power up. Now go to enabled settings and you can now disable it or maybe authorize the account. So you can authorize the account as well. Now we have enabled our Clockify integration to our board right here. If I go to power ups, then you can see we have the Clockify power up right here. I can go to settings again, as I showed you, and it will show me the power up authorize account on disable. I can click on view power up and it will again take me to all of the information right here. Now, if I create a new task, let's go ahead and create a task in to do list. So I'm going to call it test time tracker just for the purpose of the video. Now this task has been added to to do. I will simply open up the card. Now you will see I am getting the option of Clockify integration. So the one step that we didn't do before was authorize your account. Now I will simply go ahead and click on authorize and it will open up my Clockify. So as I mentioned in the start of the video, you will actually need to create an account on Clockify so that you can add to your Trello. You can see right here, it will be added to our different boards. If you want to deny the access, you can simply go ahead and deny or you can allow it. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and allow the access. Once you allow the access to Clockify, then you have the features right here. Now you can simply go ahead and track time for this project right here with your Clockify. Now, if I open up my task right here, 
you will see that I get my time tracking option, which I added from Clockify. If you do not get this option right away, you will actually need to generate an API key. So if you just find the option of Clockify right here and it says go to settings, then all you have to do is simply go to your Clockify, go to your profile settings. In profile, scroll down to generate API key right here. Click on generate and it will generate a key. Copy this one, go to your Trello and then add to your settings here. And it will be added if you do not get this option right away, but you will. So that's actually very easy to do. Now you can see I have this option right here and I can actually track time within my Trello with just one click. Once I click on this button and it will start tracking time for me. I will be able to check the linked entries in total time as well. I can also check this task right here in Clockify. So if I open up Clockify now, it will open up a redirect page for me. And you can see this is the task that is being tracked right now. You can see this is the same task that has been created automatically right here on our Clockify. And you can see right now my time is being tracked on Trello as well as Clockify. And that is how we can simply go ahead and add Clockify to our Trello. To stop, all I have to do is simply click on the stop button. And now you can see this is my time tracking. And this is the time total time for this task right here. We have linked entries. Similarly, I can actually add more than one task within a project as well. Add description and then creating a task is very easy. Now I can add labels, dates, attachments, cover, whatever I want to do. But with all of these different options, I am getting the time tracking option with my Clockify. Once you're done, close the entry and that's it. You will also be able to find the entry right here on your Clockify. And that's how simply you can track time and add Clockify integration to your Trello. I can simply now create a new task, click on new, open the card, simply wait for the Clockify integration to show. And I can click on track time. Now I can add members, labels, date. That will actually help me set the due date for my task. And I can simply go ahead, add covers. Once you're done with all of these settings, you will simply click on maybe close or maybe you can just close the task for now, but your time will keep tracking and you will be able to get access. You can see it says timer is running and I will be able to know that, okay, this task is being tracked and I can simply go ahead and pause it whenever I want to. There you go. And this is how you can simply go ahead and track time with Clockify by integrating it to Trello. This brings us to the end of the video. I hope that I was a big help to you. And now you know how to add Clockify to Trello. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the YouTube channel.